Hey everybody, what's going on? Today, let's take a look at the 2012 Bentley Continental GT. And this is going to be a full, in-depth tour of the Continental GT. We'll start it up, show the engine, get an exhaust clip, and go over the performance data, and show you a bunch of the features on the interior as well as exterior. And today, I'm at Tobin Bentley of Las Vegas in Las Vegas, Nevada. And so, without further ado, Let's go ahead and start it up, let it run. This vehicle does come equipped with a smart key access system by just keeping the key fob in your pocket and locating the little black buttons on the door handle. You can lock and unlock the vehicle. Two beeps indicate locking. After waiting a second, just put your hand behind the handle. One beep indicates unlocking. It's the Silver Lake exterior with two-tone magnolia leather interior with blue accenting, olive ash wood veneer trim, double pane laminated glass. There are also soft closing automatic doors. Now, you can start the vehicle up two ways. One, by the traditional key method, just inserting, flipping it to the right, and it'll automatically start. Or, by the push button system. Just keep the key fob on you, put your foot on the brake, and hit the button here to start. Very nice. Optional two-tone leather wrap steering wheel with the cream and dark blue color contrast stitching. Nice and tight, good sporty feel. In 2012, the Continental got a revised six-speed automatic ZF transmission with sport mode, as well as manual shifting here and by the aluminum paddle shifters behind the steering wheel for shifting up and down. Gives about 50% quicker shifts for the, versus the previous generation and eliminated a lot of lag that tended to be in the older transmission. And let's go ahead and cut on the headlights. It does have automatic lights and the hazards. All four windows are fully automatic. And let's check out the exterior, shall we? This vehicle has bi-xenon headlamps with LED main beam assist lights as well as LED daytime running lights located around the headlamp bezel. Front parking assist, does have adaptive cruise control, signature Bentley mesh grill, and that's for the adaptive cruise control. Has adaptive suspension with ride height adjustment. Beautiful paint finish. Optional 20 inch chrome wheels on Pirelli P0 tires with Bentley brake calipers. rain sensing wipers and chrome accented LED turn signals. Graceful lines, sloping rear deck, 
LED tail lamps, rear parking assist, as well as two thin oval exhaust tips, chrome finish. Backup camera. Also has a pop-up integrated spoiler here, controlled by these two buttons here. And it's variable adjustment on the way down. Then pop the hood. The Continental GT sports a 6-liter twin-turbocharged W12 engine, 48 valve with variable valve timing, produces 567 horsepower at 6,000 RPM, and 516 foot-pounds of torque at only 1,700 RPM. It is flex fuel, E85 compatible, standard all-wheel drive, 24-gallon fuel tank, with an EPA estimated miles per gallon rating on premium unleaded gas, or E85, of 12 City 19 Highway. Bentley estimates the new Continental GT to perform a 0 to 60 time of around 4.4 seconds, with an estimated top speed of around 198 miles per hour. Two-tone pattern carries into the doors with the color contrast stitching, storage down below, and the oak ash veneer paneling. Power windows, power locks, power mirrors are located up on the center console here. Trunk release, fuel cap release. The Continental GT is a completely handcrafted vehicle covered in leather, wood, as well as metal and chrome accents. It's a fully powered, perforated driver's seat with the Bentley logo stitched into the back of the headrest. Color contrast stitching. All of your full power adjustments. Three person memory. Power leg cushion extender. As well as four way lumbar adjustment and active massage. Aluminum door panels. Aluminum Bentley pedals. Full power tilting telescoping steering wheel with automatic tilt. Leather stitched headliner. And let's go and see how she sounds. Fantastic engine sound. Very smooth. Another interesting feature about this vehicle, since the seat belts are set back a little bit ways, it might be hard to reach, so as soon as you close the door, an automatic mechanism comes out to bring you the seat belt. 